I almost forgot I ordered this lens. It was something like, I don't know, four weeks ago, maybe. Really nice. We shall try it out on the big camera, right? That's 35 millimeters, quite tight. We can go wider. That's like that. I can go, I can go so wide on this 16 to 35 millimeters lens. And this is the same shot, <laughs> the same distance from camera, same room. Now you can see that we have another desk here. We have gaming corner, reading corner there. And yeah, tiny, tiny desk behind me. Yeah, and that's me like in vlogging situation. The thing is, you can see much more kind of around me. Okay, better. We are getting some sky back. Okay, here we are. I'm a little bit too bright, guys. Whatever. But yeah, basically, that's like vlogging with this lens. I think... It's kind of better than 16 millimeter lens. In the inside, it kind of looks weird, but if you are doing like, especially this kind of vertical vlogging, it's fine. It's a few hours after the rain, and that's how street looks like. And good thing with this lens is, if I am switching into the auto mode with all the crazy stabilization, everything, it is still wide enough for vlogging. What the end? <laughs> Actually, it's nice. On tripod, it was looking kind of crazy, but in this kind of vlogging mode, I can see myself vlogging with this lens. And it's very small and light, comparing, especially comparing with my 16 to 35. And that's how they look side by side 10 millimeters small and light and this one 16 to 35 yeah you can <laughs> do serious damage with this lens it's twice as big and i think twice as heavy so i'm keeping it and expect to see more videos recorded on that lens see you tomorrow bye